Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Beachley box. Um, it's the first time <laughs> in quite a while since I've done one. I think the first one I did was last spring and I just kept kind of skipping the subscription and I had a discount. I even forget what it was from, um, but instead of normally being $99 a month, I think it ended up being like 70. I had some $30 off credit from, I don't even remember why, but it's been a long day. It's Saturday, been spending the weekend or today um, cleaning out both of my fridges. And that took about over three hours. <laughs> Did a deep clean, reorganized, threw a bunch of stuff out, decluttered, all that good stuff. So, feeling accomplished. So, I'm gonna go ahead and dive into this Art Beachly box. All right. So, this is a seasonal subscription. And I'm excited to see what they sent. So, they include a giant card here of the beach, Beachly Winter uh, 2022. Um, okay, yeah, so this, on their winter box or maybe like December um, okay so welcome to your winter Beachley this season is inspired by cozy coastal evenings spent bundled up on the shore it is filled with their favorite seaside finds to transport you to winter nights spent at a beachside bonfire with a touch of island inspired details and cozy textures this box will bring an extra warmth to your white sandy winter whether you're building snowmen or sandcastles these new goodies are sure to add a splash of sunshine to the season. Are you ready to feel bundled up and beachy all winter long? Oh yes, I'm I'm excited and I'm gonna be going to the beach pretty soon. We're gonna take a little drive down to SoCal and visit Oceanside, you know, um, outside of Los Angeles, kind of in between LA and San Diego. Um, so, all right, let's see what we got. So the first item that is peeking out is this guy. I'll go ahead and show you a peek of the box, but everything's kind of like covered up, so. All right, so this one looks like a scarf. I think it's a scarf. Yeah, it's a scarf. Okay. We just kind of fold it up. Interesting. So this is an interesting style. It is definitely very lightweight, very like, like not uh, like a weighted scarf. Oh, this is cute. So honestly, this could be worn probably like into spring. Although here in California, like, I don't know. You know, actually, if I was going to Santa Cruz or something, it'd actually be perfect for that because Santa Cruz can be a little bit chilly. Um, so that's kind of nice. So this is this is cute, cute and pretty. Um, I thought there would be a slip in here. I may have to scan that little code. Hold on one second. Okay, so this is a a nice uh, digital way to scan anything. I got a mix of different things. So I guess there's a couple different possible items. Sometimes they do vary. It is kind of similar to like like Kind or another subscription boxes where you know it's, you could be getting different items. Um, okay. I wish this was more individualized though. It's all kind of mixed. Okay, now I see the scarf. Okay, bird, it's the birds of paradise. This lightweight fabric is so versatile, whether worn traditionally around the neck or tied in the hair or attached to the handle of your favorite bag. So this is really versatile. Um, so it's pretty cool. So the little, little tropical bird, so that's fun. So we got this one, Inspiration of the Land, by, okay, this is by Block and Ink. This, this retails for 45, which is quite expensive, uh, personally, but it is very, very pretty. Um, okay. Block and Ink was built off the timeless culture and inspiration of the land. Using plant and mineral dyes, they are able to uphold the integrity of a long cherished trade. So this uh, sounds like it was made by an artisan, so I can kind of get it, but it is like definitely, I'd say a little bit more out of my price point, but it is really, really cute. So I do like it maybe, you know, keep it on. Maybe I'll take it off, I don't know. But it is really cute, nice uh, lightweight scarf. So 
okay, the next one we have here is this hydrating serum by Sun Balm, enriched with banana, brown algae, and niacinamide. So, what is this? It's just, uh, oh, I guess just a serum. Okay. I've heard about this brand. That's what this looks like. I think I've maybe I've gotten some like this on like Ipsy. I don't remember. I wonder if it's, okay, here we go. So a lot of these, like for example, this one, I remember getting a couple of these items like last year when I very first got this box. So I, I've seen, I'm seeing some things get kind of recycled. Um, Okay, hydrating serum is retailed at $22. Do, do, do. Yeah, this serum is the perfect way to feel sun-kissed and glowing all winter long. So this is a moisturizer, which will be cool to try out. It is vegan and cruelty-free, made without sulfates, parabens, phytolites, and fragrance. Okay, so that is really cool. So the next one that looks like a like some sort of poncho or a jacket. So it's in this first picture, which I have one of those items already. One's a cardigan I got last year. Is it the quilted jacket? No, that's the one I got last year. So this retails at $129. You've probably seen a high-end version of this oh-so-popular quilted jacket around, but never before quite so beachy with the perfect lightweight feel, gorgeous indigo blue color, and embroidered palm detail. Uh, this is one of a kind item that will be perfect reminder of days spent by the coast as we head into cooler days. Okay. So this is what it looks like. And it does seem like this kind of style is trending right now. Especially with like Gen Z and whatnot. This is by Muse. Oh, that's cute. So that's the little fine detail. That's cute. Yeah, so it's like a like I've been seeing these quilted jackets like be totally in right now. And I don't have one actually, so that's actually kind of cute. That's cute. How I get something different. So a Muse Society, this is a small medium. So yeah, that'll be, that'll be perfect. So, that'll be cool. Whew. And it's a button up, which is really cool. That's what this one looks like. So I'm excited for that. Let's see. That's a 129 value. So the next one we have uh, is this post surf. It's actually very similar to the top I'm wearing now. This is by Post Surf, and this is a medium, like a sweater. I think this is a sage green. I thought this was sage green, but I think this might be more of a teal color. I think it might be more on the teal side. You guys tell me, sage or teal? So, ooh, ooh, nice. I like the I like the material. Ooh, I like this a lot. So it has like this little leaf design. Look at that. It looks like lily pads. I like my sweaters to be oversized. I know there's a lot that are like cropped, but I like I like my sweaters oversized. And this is cute. And this is a medium, so it's definitely more of an oversized fit. So we love. So I'm gonna tell you about that brand real fast. Looks like I got a mix of different winter boxes, but they were careful to make sure that I didn't get any items I've previously gotten from them, which is nice. Yeah, poster of collection. Let's see. Inspired by the city, the tropics, and everyone in between, poster of collective is reminiscent of that poster feeling many beachgoers have grown to love and seek. Salty, breezy, warm. Golden hour vibes are important in the post-surf collections and wish to bring the inspiration of surf travels to you. Very, very cool. Okay, so I'm going up and down because they, there's a couple different examples and I got different items. And so I, I really appreciate that. They made sure to, to give me items that I haven't received before, so I really appreciate that, especially since it is a higher uh, price point for this box. 
ones we got are some socks. Actually, I've been really needing some socks this winter. Um, they seem to disappear. I don't know. They just seem to go away, away, away. They just disappear on me, so I'm uh, excited to get another pair, especially like a beach inspired. Oh, this is by the Salt Sisters Co. This is for the Sun Seekers. Ooh, these are very cute. Very similar style to that, um, to that like sage colored um, sweatshirt. So this is very, very cute. Nice and soft, soft slipper socks. Been perfect, especially since I've, I've had like uh, wooden floors. This has just been, I've been loving these. <laughs> Even just like to walk around in like when it's during the winter time. If you know, you know. So, hydrating serum. Okay, so the Mon Monstera Fuzzy Socks by the Salt Sisters retail price at $18. And, Okay. Salt Sisters is the go-to site for daily discoveries by and for sun seekers. Ever wanted to see the cutest beachy content? Links to cur curated coastal products to purchase and just a really fun all over beach style page. Look no further than the Salt Sisters for the best beach content. Now I'm realizing I didn't tell you how much the sweatshirt retailed, but let's just look real quickly. So the sweatshirt retailed for 60. So that's pretty cool. Okay. All right, so I think this is the last item here. And I think this is a little tray. So let's see. Yeah, it's a little tray. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. Look at that. Oh, I love the little speckled design. Look at that. It is so cute. It has those beachly on the back. That is, that is adorable. I love this. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. Oof. So I, it's definitely not meant for bigger soap, but you can put like a small little soap bar on here, or even like you know those little shampoo soap bars. Those would work perfect on these, like in your shower. Um, I have some of those. I haven't tried it, but I've heard it's life changing. So hopefully it those things hold up let me know if you've tried the like the shampoo bars um like and know what you think okay so these okay so this one the sand speckled seashell um this is retailed at 25 dollars the seashell tray is perfect for a little bit of coastal flair um and you can use it uh by using it as a jewelry storage or feature in your kitchen as a spoon rest oh spoon rest um Oh, didn't even think about those two things. I was thinking like little little bars of soap. Um, but yeah, that's pretty versatile. And put a little set with rings on it. So I'll have to think about what I'm gonna do with it. But I really love that everything in this box is so functional, like something I can wear or use. Um, because a lot of subscription services, like sometimes you get like, I don't know, like um, Women's Collective or FabFitFun, or you get some like randoms, like you're like, I don't know if I'll be able to use this. But these are all functional. I'll be like using every single one of these pieces. Um, so we got a total of five pieces. And the box, uh, as I said, is uh, normally $99. So we have this at 60, this at like, I think it was like 160 or something like that. Um, and then that at 18, yeah, so this box, is let me see valued at okay. okay so this whole box comes out at 299 so this whole box is a 300 dollar value and you pay 99 dollars. so that's pretty that's pretty good um it's very similar to ipsy where you get like i think three times what the cost of the box is as far as valued of products so I'm, I'm pretty happy with this. I think this is a great deal, especially since a lot of these things are um, by small businesses. Now, you know, this isn't something that like you can just go grab at a regular box store. Um, so I can understand like the higher price point just because the cost to make, especially if it's a more local um, brand. So I think this is cute. I don't have any, but I know like these seem to be like really in right now on trend, um, especially maybe I'll take this I think I'll maybe take a couple of these items when I drive to Oceanside. 
um, perfect timing for that. I'm gonna also uh, see Catalina Island. It's kind of a quick trip. Um, it's like we're taking a four day weekend. We're just, you know, just gonna enjoy yourself. So I'm really excited about that. So yeah, guys, please let me know what you thought of this box. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, share, all that good stuff. And if I have a little code for a discount for y'all, I'll put that down below as well. And I'll see you guys next time. I found a perfect girl She's from another world She puts a smile on my face